Hey everyone, Miyowski here. Welcome back. Today I thought we would uh, do a few things actually, depending on what time allows for. But I saw this bottled bloodsucker blood, which sounds really interesting, especially if I can get it on the right character. 25% uh, bleed chance, 20% damage if the blood is in the inventory, 15% uh, healing received if below 33 HP, and then on hit self, plus 2 HP, plus 4 if the target is bleeding. This could be really good in any group I use for the Crimson Courtyard, and just overall some groups I just use around Hamlet. So I think I'm actually going to go get this rather than go get the Shrieker like I said in the last episode and then if time allows go get the Shrieker afterwards. So let's get to it. Um, <laughs> I couldn't actually think of a good group to use for this. Um, I couldn't put together one because all of my groups are kind of either dying or uh, not really in a good place right now. Um, so I'm using a Seraph, a Duchess, a Lamia, and then I couldn't find out who I really wanted to use in my role 3. So I was kind of debating between Dannenville and an Occultist for more healing, just in case the Lamia went down like last time. So I was kind of leaning towards Osmond the Occultist. That way he can also mark for the Seraph. Um, so yeah, let's just see how this goes. Now this is a long um, in the Warrens. I've not had particularly good luck here lately, so let's see how this goes. I am really going to overstock on some supplies, I know that. So let's just see how this goes. The dreaded Grand is sure to breach your defenses if it reaches you. Oh god, don't tell me Grand is in here. They breed quickly down there in the dark. But perhaps we can slay them even faster. Actually, no. It'll be easier to go up and around like that. Alright. So, we're going to up how much damage we do to the ghoul. I think we're going to instantly transform her. That's also why I decided to bring the Lamia. I don't remember what she all actually does, though. Uh, we can stun with her. Okay. Let's stun the ghoul. With Osmond. Let, I think this is the mark, yeah. Let's mark for the Seraph. Ow! That hurts, sir. And then she can finish one off. Round two, getting rid of Blight. Marking again, so we can finish it off immediately. Stun again. The ground quakes. Finishing this one off. Marking him. Uh, suppose we're going to get rid of that light. And which does the most? I suppose it's Feed the Beast. And then we have to do this one. The bigger the beast, All right. the greater the glory. The light, the promise of safety. Change giant, huh? 
right, let's de-stress because that's what she's good at. We are transforming again. Can I stun him? I can stun him. Not at a very good chance, but it's worth a shot. We are then going to... You know what? Let's artillery. Power bow blow. That way we can put some hurt on him. He's gonna kill them. Pork cedar. Surges as the enemy crumbles. She is de-stressing again. Let's kill him. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Marking. Ooh. Not what I was hoping for, but we can make it work. The match is struck. A blazing Healing. star is born. Uh, let's see if we can stun. There we go. Marking again. And let's rip him apart. There goes that on him. Let's heal up. Need the beast. Try to take him out. Marking again. And... Ouch. Up goes the weasel. Eyes alone does not dissuade the sharp blade. Yeah. Nothing great. I don't think anything really works here, so let's leave that alone. I'd prefer her There's stepping on it over anyone else. No clemency in this place. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let's do what we do best. The blood quickens. Uh, let's stun the Reaver since we can do that. Yep. Gotta alter the strategy a little bit. Let's take out the Marcher. And with her, take out the Marcher. Getting rid of the blight. Let's, uh, I suppose feed the beast. Abyssal artillery again, and we got him. Is broken. Maintain the offensive. Okay. Let's start going at the Reaver, taking him out, and then we can deal with the Rocket Giant. Oh, all of the eyes glow. Weakened. What? Alright, we're gonna mark him for now. Feed the Beast. I think she's at the threshold, so let's do it. Very nice. Okay. Okay, we, we got this. Marking again. Healing. Get rid of the blight. Why is it that every time I come in here recently, like, I find two or three new things that just 
63. Wow. Should have used a bank token. Are just absolutely ludicrous. Slow and insidious killer. Really? Another giant? What is this? Alright, uh, we're gonna do this. I'm actually gonna stun one of the corpse eaters. Or at least try to. We're gonna mark the giant. Exposed to a killing blow. We're gonna get rid of that blight. I don't care if it puts her above where she needs to be. And then we're gonna remove one of these other corpse eaters. Alright, buddy. Game on. Let's de-stress so we can get her down as well. Uh, let's stun. Darn. He's marked, so we're not gonna deal with that. So let's try to get rid of the corpse here. Give them no quarter. Firing main laser. Death waits for the slightest lapse in concentration. Oof. Healing. Marking. Stunning. I really wish he didn't get that attack back if he's stunned, but whatever. And crippling. Probably should have healed, uh, Osmond there, but okay. Perhaps a turning point. Giant Shackles. Minus 20% damage on whoever they're on, but friendly skill buff. Sell for 10% damage on attack hit. Buff sell for 10% damage. So after two hits or skills, you get 10% damage. Interesting. 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 Let's try this out. Uh, bandages for that. A fortune waiting to be spent. It looks like if I go up, I'm best off. Alright, 60, 60. This is not good. Treasure room. And secret room. There's those slavering cultists again. Uh, Alright, you know what? We're gonna heal Osmond so he can do other things. Why would one guard the other? We're gonna try to stun one. Now, that would work. Okay. We're gonna mark one. I don't care who. And she is going to rip him apart. Right. Uh, we, we need to heal our Lamia. Stun the corpse eater. Mark who you can, so we killed up one cultist. Oh. Owie. Uh, you're, you're the healer that you should be healing yourself. Okay, one down. Here, guard the worm. That, that makes sense. Momentary Osmond is no longer bleeding. Need to 
beast, healing her up a little bit. Gonna mark him again. And rip and tear. only two damage for one round, so we'll heal our Lamia again, which worked out really well. I'll mark him. That actually works out. That will put her where we want her health-wise. Decimated. A trifling victory. But and a victory what's in this? You know, I'll take it. That's like almost 10,000 gold. Not what I wanted. Don't remember what these do. Resolve experience. Okay, I will take that. Nothing too big here. Do want to get rid of that spider though. So transform we go. And now annihilated. Wonder how tasty that was. All right. Uh, let's de-stress. I think that's more important right now. Ringing ears. Blurred vision. The end approaches. Marking him. And firing main laser. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. Right, we do need to heal her. It wasn't for too much, that's good. We're going to mark the cutthroat this time, so we can take him out. We're gonna stun the blood letter, hopefully. If not, no big deal, but okay. We will need to heal her. Cutthroat down. Getting rid of the bleed, healing. Need the beast to heal a little more. You know, I'm gonna gamble and try to heal him a little bit. Okay, paid off, and I think we disintegrated him. It's gotta be my favorite move on that Sarah there. Brought low and driven into the mud. All right. But we do need to go both ways there. And probably Break camp here once. Huddled together, furtive and vulnerable, rats in a maze. I was wondering what was going on here, and I real I just realized that her mask plate is up. <laughs> right, remove disease on one companion. I don't think that works on her though. Minus stress on self. Everyone else gets stress. No. That could be really good if she had the uh, purse on her. But you know what we're gonna do? Final verdict. <laughs> and then we can... Uh, where is it? Divine being for less stress. He has a thing for less stress on her, I thought. So we'll do that. Then we can encourage to reduce stress. We don't need to do that, so what we will do is... Pep talk again. That way she gets even less stress, and I think we're good. 
darkness closes in. The hearts of oh no, not the chieftain. No, sir. No grand for you. No grand for you. Back by two. I think that means she can do her thing. Uh, we're going to up crit rate on him. And then blam. Guard failed. <laughs> I forgot he did that part. Alright, let's heal. Mark. He has a lot of health to rip through. He got grand out. Well, we can at least make sure we don't take damage from everything else. And do that to, like, rip and tear. <laughs> do not get Grand any closer to me. Hey, can we stun it? Okay, we stunned it. What? I don't want it any closer, so I'm not going to use the up crit rate on it. Oh. Okay then. Uh, heal yourself, sir. Mortality. That's one heck of a slap. He has a lot of protection. Um, yeah, we might as well go at Grand. Really? Yeah, we're not gonna stun him again. So what we can do is... Just try to tear him apart and heal. They did. Oh. Okay, well, there goes that. Alright, Osmond, you're not dying on me, sir. Yeah, let's get Grand again. I think I have to get it this turn. 60% damage at, against Mark, so it's basically going to kill her. Oh, I guess the crit got it. That was a sheer luck. <laughs> Alright, uh, you know, what we're going to do is get rid of that guard. And we're gonna mark him. Muster the herd, but no one came. Then, laser. I think Chief is dead. What's this? Promises success. The Forsaken Third War Banner. For two chance, max HP up. That's actually pretty good. Alright, so... Obviously, want that. Um, quite honestly, I'll take that. I have a few steel and bells, so that's fine. Kind of tempted to uh, camp again, but I'm not going to. Anything else I can get rid of in here, though? I 
forgot to use the estate tokens again. I really need to just stop bringing these things because I don't like using them in the first place. And then I always forget to use them. So screw it. Alright, let's go up. Turn her party order. Watch your step. Gast brawls. Yikes, they can hurt. Let's stun. Yes, yeah, stun one of them. I'm actually going to mark this one rather than do the uh, artillery. We're then going to get some stress down on everyone because everyone's really bad in that regard. And we're going to try to take out the march. another one. Uh, I probably should heal her. Marking one so we can kill it. Oh, it has three whole health left. Four, actually. I think this is going to kill it. No. Okay, we're gonna stun another one. We are going to de-stress more. I would say kill one, but that's not gonna work. So let's mark this one. We still got it. Yikes. Perched at the very precipice of oblivion. Alright, I think we can get this one now. That gets rid of some stress too because she crit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Right. I doubt this is gonna kill him, so we're good. We're gonna heal so that she uh, doesn't have anything bad happen to her. Marking, not that we need it. And firing main laser. There's some stress down. Don't need the citrine, that can be left. I do believe I can use this D. No. So is this an ant? Why? Just as a test. <laughs> of course, of course, of course. All right, we are gonna move her forward. We, uh, we have to de-stress. Marking it. Yikes. But we can, uh... If I'm gonna use that thing, I'm gonna use it. Alright, de-stressing more. No, 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 no. All right, well, marking him again, or it again. I think we just have to ignore the justice for now. Duchess. This is gonna hurt. Both of us, it seems. Okay, do or die. 
themselves. Duchess is going to go before she has a chance. So this is kind of a gamble here. If the Mimic kills her, I lose. We need to heal. As long as I would hit, I would have won. Intrinsic wealth. be considered a virtue. Damage versus bleeding. Good for my bleeding groups. Stress damage received up on melee attack. Very good chance to bleed them. Huh. Yes, we will be taking that. Yes, we will be taking that. Oh boy. You know what? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, at least seven fights ahead of us. We need to de-stress. Gathered close in tenuous firelight, an uneasy companionship. Anyone else have a de-stressing thing? I mean, I suppose I could abandon hope and do that. I really want to do final verdict. Okay, this is the plan. We're, we're gonna do final verdict on everyone and then... Yeah, I think that's okay. This has been... A run. <laughs> like, I, I don't... What is with this run? Piled high and cloaked in palace. I think out of everything, the Collector is the one I can manage the best. There, he's stunned. <laughs> Gonna make sure he can get crit. And he can't be guarded for now. Marking so we can do more damage. She can't fire her laser, but we can still chunk him out. Uh, I suppose since he has all that stuff on him, we're gonna de stress. We're not gonna stun him again, so we're gonna go for damage. Marking again. And kaboom. Inspiration and improvement. I, I don't think she can hit him. So we're gonna stun the Vestal. Once again de-stressing. This has been one heck of a run. I don't care about your collection, sir. After everything I've been through. That is the least of my concerns in here. You're trying to be scary, and you're not. Vestal goes bye-bye. De-stressing. Oh, that's how you're gonna play this, huh? That's how you're gonna play this, huh? Fine, we'll play that way. Hide. Hide behind your little minions. We, we can play that game. Yep, yep. just gave it up. What good was that? Uh, she is going to heal herself since she's bleeding now. <laughs> I 
I've had enough of your shenanigans, sir. A predator is often blind to its own peril. Barristan's head this time. Momentum. Push on to the task's end. Okay. We're gonna get rid of the Gambler's Charm for the journal page, and we'll do that. I think we're gonna lay off on her stress for a little bit. Let's get rid of the marcher first. I kind of want to get rid of the spawn, but we'll do that turn two or so. We're going to de-stress while we can, because she's not gathering it very quickly. And just take him out. And both of our front rows are repulsed, so they're going to kill themselves. She is really not doing good. I think that's her second or third disease this run. A terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. That's fine. I'm still just gonna de-stress. Alright, we're marking. De-stressing. Firing at the laser, which will de-stress even more. So what that allows us to do is use some of this food. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Another journal page, huh? I don't think we need the blood for now. Does this do anything on it? Nope. Looks like it actually broke it. Huh. Interesting. Once again, we kind of need to de-stress that little bit. Not what I was hoping for. Alright, uh... I guess we're gonna keep de-stressing. Okay, good dodge. We're gonna get rid of the marcher. And kerblam. I think we deleted him. You know what, I'm not comfortable with this health being that low. Summon on me, sir. Right, we are going to mark this one. That gets rid of its Aegis as well. Getting rid of the glass. I don't like spiders. Getting rid of that Astral, so I can't summon. goes away. And... Oh boy. I'm not making up that stress I want to. As victories mount, so too will resistance. There's that bullfrog again. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Let's uh, continue working on that stress. Guess we have to mark. A 
and you're the only one left now, sir. Stressing. Ah, uh, we'll go for it. As close he can heal himself, that's what he can do. Twenty five. Wow. Nightmarish creatures can be felt. They can be beaten. But it said a hundred percent of them. What's in this room? What's in this room? I'm very concerned now. I I have to find out. I'll I'll go the long way so I don't have to uh, fight that extra battle and have the extra stress. But the quest was for a hundred percent of room battles. This is a room battle. Is the game glitched or is this something big? And I understand now how many torches I actually bought and it was way too many, but nonetheless. Of course, of course. So, I guess get rid of the drummer. We're going to de stress. Stop moving her. Would this get no it wouldn't. So let's mark him. So I want to take him out pretty quickly. And I have a kind of a plan for this. Firing a laser. Oh boy. And now the true test. Hold fast or expire. Oh man, that's what got her. Position in this sprawling tomb. Well, at least we still have a backup healer. I I do understand that this was a very bad choice to keep going. Do not get me wrong there. Alright, let's go for this. Um, still gonna go for him. She can take the hit. He needs to heal himself. Done him. He's going to do a double. Oh no. Frustration and fury. More destructive than a hundred cannons. Okay. This may get a little rough. Pretty sure he's going to die when he goes. Even the agent Oak will fall to the Tempest's wings. Uh, yeah, let's let's keep the work on him. I'm not 
not sure how this is going to work. Alright, let's... I suppose we have to go at him. That's probably going to kill her. the drummer down at least. Yeah, let's kill him. Just leaving Scavenger. I had to figure that was gonna happen. More ashes. More disappointment. Yep, yep, you do your thing, dude. Is no place for really or the foolhardy. Well, let's do this. And I do 32 damage before he kills me. Uh, we do have this. This. And this. Might as well use it. I didn't think he had that move. Their squeals fade. Their confidence is shaken. That was a really, really good run, and I got too greedy. Well, things happen. So, on the plus side, the Shrieker is there to recover lost trinkets. So anything I lost there, I can technically pick up. What I'm not sure about is anything that I found might also be able to be picked up because we did find a few cool things in there too. So we will most definitely be doing the Shrieker next time and then picking up from there. Um, <laughs> I know this has been a, a lot of scuffed runs in a row, but finding out some of these things about uh, some of these DLCs is kind of fun. And uh, that last run in particular, how many freaking mini bosses can you fit into a single run that that was something so uh that's where i'm gonna leave this one not sure what we're gonna do after the shrieker next time it'll have to see what's all available but that's the first thing on my agenda to get some of that stuff back and as always i wish you all well i'll see you next time and please have a good one